artist book is, is a work of art created by an artist or, or a set of people who are collaborating to do a book-like object. It is a structure that references the known object book that artists use to present their ideas, visual and written or otherwise. You can have a codex book like an album that you flip the pages over and over or you can have a, an object that opens out like a sculpture. They have to have some relationship. My work is to try to make things easier to understand. The content of artist books can be as varied as their physical, their physical appearance. Books are <laughs> amongst the best things in the world. An artist's book is a handcrafted container of nourishment for the mind and soul. Originally, I really, really wanted to tell a story. Best Tunisia is a living museum of ancient history, anthropology, and archaeology. As I go through this section, um, I ultimately end up um, to a scene from the desert where insects have gone through the, the sand and created this beautiful pattern. The, the format of the book um, lends itself to um, different sections so that what you see here, uh, this relates to all of the, the pages following. There's just so much to learn about Tunisia, about Africa. In 1993, I created my first major artist book called the Grace Kwame Sculpture. So you can open it up, it can dip in from any part, any page. <laughs> the subject of the book, um, who happens to be my mother, Grace Salome Kwame, is an outstanding artist. I had been working on this for some years. It was a long gestation period, collecting photographs and material, but I didn't know what form, what form it would take. As a tribute, I decided to, to honor her with this um, uh, book, this artist book. The artist book, it's the real passport. To, to the world. I wanted to do a, something like a, a portrait book of Moroccans, but the whole society. In Morocco, I was taking pictures of people and I started to talk with the people that I was taking pictures. It takes me a while to find a way to express myself. I wanted to share the whole, the whole thing with the outside world. The Ultimate Safari is a book we did in collaboration with Nadine Gordeman and the stories about refugees who flee Mozambique and walk to South Africa. The story is about journeying through the Kruger Park on foot and facing the wild animals and the losses along the way and um, leaving Mozambique to basically flee the war and come to South Africa for the hope of a better life. really worked out beautifully in the end and the story is absolutely heart moving and beautiful. I've been working in the field of the artist books for since uh, 1980, <laughs> so 34 years now or so. This is my copy of uh, Imandolo Recreation. It's an edition of 30. Um, done by 22 artists in an eight-day period in a studio in uh, South Africa in Johannesburg. I wanted to create a mix between people who generally didn't mix together, which were these artists in this community, in this, in this group of communities that makes up the South African art world. The idea of the book was to ask the, each artist to focus on the duality aspect of their creation myth. I made general areas, so head, neck in one section, torso, genitalia in the other, and then the, uh, the legs in the bottom area and gave them the measurements. 
fact that I spend my day making these things that give me so much makes me eternally happy anyway. Many people say, oh, I never knew there was such a thing as an artist book. Certainly the last 10 years, the genre has really flourished. They are having maybe ways to express this, to express the same thing in different ways. We appropriate traditional structures and change them and transform them. You can look around and books were made in so many different ways in different cultures that there's an awful lot of possibilities. A variety of uh, shapes and forms of artist books, you'll be able to maybe take away the spirit of um, creativity and the joy of um, making.